Hello friends, Dr. Missy Clifton here with my beautiful patient, Roxana. She has just entered her 50s, she's right at 51. And so we're gonna talk about the rejuvenation of the skin at this age. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna assess her face with you. First of all, I'm gonna have you raise your eyebrows really high for me. Perfect, and frown for me. Excellent, and smile really big for me. Excellent. So we will be doing some Botox. We will do most of the Botox off of camera because I know you guys have seen a lot of Botox footage already. But we will be doing some Botox in her crow's feet, in this glabellar area to soften these lines. And we'll do a tiny bit in the forehead, but way up high because we don't want to relax this frontalis muscle that elevates the brow. So we'll be doing that off camera later on today. To start with on filler, we noticed that she has lost a little bit of volume in her cheekbone, which has caused her to have a little bit of a tear trough here. So we'll be doing a little bit of Voluma. She's also has kind of loss of jaw definition. So we'll be doing a little bit of the Voluma in the pre jowl sulcus, this area, and also at the angle of the jaw. And a little bit of volume loss at the corner of the mouth where we'll do a little bit of Juvederm Ultra Plus. And then very fine lines around the mouth where we'll do just a little bit of Juvederm Ultra. So we're gonna be doing Voluma, and I'm doing a cannula, which is a blunt tipped instrument. So it's mostly just pressure. And then we're gonna come down and we're gonna do a little bit across the jawline down here. Now I'm gonna take the same product, but we're gonna take it on a needle, and we're gonna do a little bit a little bit more superficially, just to kind of recreate this angle of the jaw here. And then we're gonna go right in this little area where we have this little ligament that causes what we call the pre gel sulcus. And we're gonna come right out from it where I've already numbed her a little bit and go right down on the bone there. And then one last little stick right directly into that sulcus. Very nice, I love it. This is Juvederm Ultra Plus. It's going to last for at least a year. Um, and it's really good for areas where you have some volume loss, but you still, you don't want to necessarily see a lot of stiffness or thickening. So this is gonna be really pretty at the corner of the mouth. So with every injectable treatment that we do, we encourage all of our patients to really do their homework and support their skin at home with really great products so that they continue to get the best result from the products that we inject in the skin, and they also prevent more damage from happening. So for people in our 50s, we really all want a sunscreen. My favorite is Total Defense and Repair, it always has been. I love HA5 before the sunscreen. HA5 is a hyaluronic acid compound that has multiple types that help to plump and rebuild the hyaluronic acid naturally in your skin. We just injected a lot of products that have hyaluronic acid. So we wanna support that at home with the HA5. We think everyone in our 50s needs to be on a retinol. In addition, in the morning as your very first step, even before the HA, we definitely wanna do some growth factors and some antioxidants. And I love TNSA+. It's my favorite of all of the topicals out there to really rejuvenate, rebuild, and support your skin as a whole. You can use it morning and at night as well.